outfit is so cute. It's a two-piece outfit. And I bought it from Tiger Fox Boots, which is a really cute online store. Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. And look, I broke a nail this morning because while I'm doing this video, I'm also doing laundry and I was trying to open the soap but it had like those side things where you... Let's just wait. I'm really trash can, really? Now you have to come. <clears throat> I thought it came on Wednesdays. It's Friday. So like I was saying, what was I saying? Oh yeah, this is um, a wild idea that I got. And it has like these tabs on the side where you have to press them at the same time and twist. And like since I have these monsters, I couldn't really like press and twist. And then that's how this beautiful thing came off. And my dumbass didn't realize that within each wig, they also gave you a free hairnet to wear. To keep all your hair together. So I bought like three or four separately. And all of them came with a hairnet. So I just spent money for nothing. This is the first wig. And right now my phone just turned off because the alarm went off saying that my laundry is ready. So I'm gonna go quickly do that and come back. See you guys in a bit. So after this video, I'm gonna go to a spa. I don't know where exactly yet because it's sort of like a surprise with my mentor who has been super nice to me and has always supported me. But um, that's not why I made this video. Showing you guys what I bought from Amazon. And in this purchase, I spent like $76 around there. I sort of did like a recording on when I was buying the item. So I, so I hope I didn't delete that video so I can show it to you guys later. So yeah, we're gonna get started because I have to go at 11 and it's like 10, 12 right now. So time is clicking. So this is the first wig that I got. It came in this blue box. All of these wigs that I, that I bought um, had their own hairnets. So I did the mistake in buying hairnets separately because I didn't read the description. So, good job, Sophia. So it comes in like this. This is not the hairnet. This is just to keep it together. The hair cap, or I call it hairnet, but it's like the cap. And I should probably do that. Okay, I'm gonna wear this one. Or should I wear the black one? I can't find the black one, so I'll just wear this one. Within this purchase, I also bought these special brushes. They already have hair, or wig hair, on them because it's specially for that. So I'm gonna quickly just do a bun. And I wish I should have like strained my hair before I done I did this because my hair is thick. So it's gonna be a fat bun in the back. <clears throat> As I go behind my ears, I'm going to pull every hair back as I can and tuck that in in the back. I 
There we go. I guess. I've never bought wigs before, so I'm not really sure how to put them on. <laughs> but we're gonna try. So this is the first one. I love how it's... I love how it's wavy and the length of it. I love this color. And then the roots on the top are like kind of dark and they sort of blend in with the silvery blonde color. This is how the front looks like. It's kind of weird. Not really digging the front, but... I don't even know if this goes this way. Which way do you go? I think it goes this way. Okay. <clears throat> so I'm gonna try to put it on right now to show you guys. And this is how like the cat part looks like where it'll be attached. But like I'm a blind bitch, so, so like I gotta see. I need my two eyes. <laughs> this one seems very fake to me. Like it just doesn't feel like if it were a natural. Just doesn't look a natural lot. So let me know what you guys think about this wig. Do you guys like it? This is what the brush does to the wig. <clears throat> There's not a lot of fallout either, so that's really good. Because I hate it. I mean, my hair is already enough. I kind of like it now with more that it's brushed. <clears throat> So I'm going to put it back into its hairnet so it doesn't get all tangled up and messed up because that's going to be a pain and a waste of money. This next wig that I bought is a blondie with dark roots. It's more like a light brown. And this one's super long. I'm going to figure out how it goes. See this one I did a bad job in putting back. In the, it has clips. So it makes it easier to stay in. Okay. I like this one. This one looks more natural. Even though it's super long. Like I probably cut it down a bit. Look at how real this hairline looks like. That's pretty damn real. I have to fix it a little bit better, but it makes it look natural. This was also a lace synthetic wig. Let me get up so you guys can see how long it is. Yeah, the length is the only thing that bothers me from this wig. Everything else is beautiful. So this is definitely one of my favorites and I will probably go to in public with this one. Let's see how it looks in the back. <laughs> it's so cute. Makes me want to go blonde. This is why I bought wigs. So I stop damaging my own hair because my hair has been crying for the past few months. So, so let me know what you guys thought about this wig. Do you guys like it? Okay, I'm going to show you guys the last wig because I gotta go quick. I don't care why I want to take this off. Okay, I'm going to leave this one out because I plan to take pictures with it after. Now I'm going to be getting picked up. So. That's even worse if I make the person wait. I 
hate making people wait. Ugh, and I hate it when people make me wait. This next one is just a simple black one. Because I know I love black hair, that's why I dyed mine black. And since I know I have light hair, I don't want to be continuously dyeing it. So. This one has like less hair than the other ones. So we'll see how that covers the back. This one didn't have a lace in it, so it looks more like fake to me from the hairlines. Bad. Not bad, actually. I can't really see how it covers the back, so you like you guys had gotta tell me. This is probably like the most natural wig that I bought. The second one would be like the blonde one, and then lastly that silver looking one. This cute. Or what do you guys think? Which one looks the most natural? And which one do you guys like the most on me? Comment below. This one does feel natural actually. Like, it feels like actual hair. I'll show you guys how long it is. This one came in this black bag. This is from Christmas. I don't know how to say that well. It's called a wig cap. The other one is called Hair Focus Long Ombre Gray Wigs Dark Roots Wavy Curly Synthetic Free Part Full Wigs Cosplay Party Nun Lace Replacement wig that's a long ass name but this is this one and I don't remember exactly the price but I'll let you guys know later once I check and then this one the long wig is called the Christmas it's also from the same brand as the last one fashion ombre blonde glueless lace front wig two-tone color light brown roots number 12 Side part long, natural straight. That's a long one too. Long description. The last one was a quantum love lace part natural wave wig. Long, wavy, heat resistant, synthetic daily party, replaceable wigs for women, natural. And so those are the names for all of those three wigs and I bought them all from Amazon. The ones I do recommend is the blonde one with light brown roots and the black synthetic wig gives a very natural look to those who already have like dark rooted hairs hair dark root hair i don't know how you say it, but you know what i mean and look i bought all these caps for no reason because these wigs already came with caps. So I just spent money. You're welcome, Amazon. Okay? So I'm gonna end this video by wearing this one because it's my favorite. So this is the end of the video. Bye. Just kidding. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe and like this video. Leave all the links to these hair. I'll leave all the links to these wigs down below in the description, so make sure to check them out if you guys are interested in buying them. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Hope you guys like this video. Subscribe. <laughs> Bye.